welcome to the Miami Herald Business Show. I'm Nyla Budu. With the holiday season approaching, retailers are keeping an eye on many indicators that might predict how consumers are going to behave this year. One barometer is Florida's Consumer Confidence Index. In October, the overall index measured 72, the same as in September, but it was 10 points higher than last year. Joining me now to give us an insider's preview of the holiday season is Miami Herald business reporter Elaine Walker. Elaine, thanks for coming in today. Thanks. Hi, Nell. So you've covered uh, retail for about 12 years now. Obviously, last year was the worst holiday season you've ever seen. What do you think is going to happen this year? I mean, clearly this year is not going to be as bad as last year which is a good thing, but it's obviously not going to be a good holiday season. It's not even going to be an average holiday season. It will be a season that forecasters are saying could see sales anywhere from down 1% to flat, or maybe the optimistic view is up 1% or 2%. That's still well under the 10-year average of what holiday season sales normally are. But consumers are starting to feel a little better in some degrees in the fact that they will come out and spend. But clearly what consumers are looking for this year is value. They want to make sure they're getting their money's worth, whether that be quality for a good price or a discount low price. So if you were a consumer, would you hit the Black Friday sales or would you wait? Well, there will be a lot of good sales out for Black Friday because retailers want to get consumers in their doors and spending early. So look for the bargains on Black Friday, but also beware that this year retailers have managed their inventories very well. So if you wait until the last minute, there's not likely to be big piles of inventory that they're going to have to dramatically reduce prices in order to move it off the shelf. So you will probably not see the 70% off sales you saw last year. So from a business standpoint, do you think that retailers are going to actually have pretty good healthy earnings um, when they're reporting out? This year, retailers are expected to do better than last year because they have managed for this season. They have kept inventories low, which means they shouldn't have to do massive discounting that's unplanned. So they should have better bottom lines than last year. But again, volumes won't be what they were you know, three, four years ago. So they won't do as well as they've done in many years past. But certainly, their performance will be better than last year. OK, great. Thank you so much, Elaine. Thanks. For its part, the Florida Retail Federation is predicting a mixed year. According to its holiday projections, the industry group expects big box retailers like Target and Walmart to do well, but department stores may not. Have a happy Thanksgiving, and thanks for watching. For the Miami Herald Business Show, I'm Nyla Boodoo.